Queen Elizabeth Olympic Park is a fantastic example of a smart and sustainable urban park that is really trying to manage those 21st century challenges in a brand new integrated way. The Smart London Plan identifies the Olympic Park as a key demonstrator space and working with the GLA and NGOs we are showing how you can use technology and smart city initiatives in such a space and this will be fed into future regeneration environments and future developments both across London, Europe and indeed globally. We're looking at how we can make the most of smart data to really drive our approaches across the range of other programs that we're working on. We've implemented a free-to-use Wi-Fi system across the park and the venues. It's probably the first time that's been done in such a large urban parkland as this. We've also launched a smartphone app and that shows people before they come to the park what events are on and what they can come and see and do. They can use the map, which is part of that application, to navigate their way around the park. We're building tens of thousands of homes and also there will be tens of thousands of jobs on the park. At Here East we will have both large and small commercial companies who are both in the tech and also the maker space. We will have universities on the park, that will be University College London, Loughborough University and University of Arts London and we'll have a cultural quarter which will include institutions such as the v &A and Sadler's Wells. This gives us a unique opportunity to both bring what they do and their use of technology into how we engage with visitors, residents and workers and indeed students. Queen Elizabeth Olympic Park is one of the first of a growing network of European districts that are part of a Climate Kick sponsored programme called Smart Sustainable Districts. We are looking at how we can increase the resource efficiency of two of our iconic Briam excellent venues within the park and those two are the London Aquatic Centre and the Copper Box Arena. We're really looking to understand the data that is being logged by the building management systems within both of those venues and how to then use that in conjunction with other data streams that we're getting both from the district energy network and in some cases that will be completely new data feeds for us that we'll be installing as part of our Smart Park Future Living initiative. We're also looking to build in qualitative data and that's really important to us because if we think about user experience, there's no point in us making those buildings as efficient as possible if they become really uncomfortable for people to use and so marrying these data sets really enables us to do something quite special when it comes to adopting a 21st century management approach to our park. The way that we'll use the technology and the smart city applications and solutions that we've used on the park will be used by lots of other people, which will really drive forward the great experience which people will have, whether they're living, visiting or working on the park. We're looking at how we can improve visitor, user and community engagement with this entire agenda. So really trying to crack that nut, which is how do we continue to innovate? How do we continue to lead the lifestyles that we want to without depleting the Earth's natural resources? Music